O is the center of the circle, and the perimeter of triangle ROS is 6. So what's greater, the circumference of the circle or 12? How do I calculate the circumference of a circle? Well, that's going to be 2 times pi times the radius, 2 pi r. If you want to make your life even easier, you could say uh, pi times the diameter. So we need the radius or the diameter to find what the circumference is. Do we have the radius of circle, uh, circle O? Well, we don't know what it equals, but we actually have two radii in this picture. There's OS right there and OR right there. And although I don't know what they equal, I do know that they're equal to each other. Which means, since there are two equal sides of this triangle, ROS, that ROS is isosceles. And if ROS is isosceles, then I have two equal angles, two equal sides, two equal, ang two equal angles. That's what an isosceles triangle is. Now, the sum of angles in a triangle is 180 degrees, right? I've already accounted for 60 of those degrees right there with uh, angle O. So I'm going to subtract that out, and I'm left with 120. So these two equal angles add up to 120, meaning that each of them is 60. Aha! So ROS is not just isosceles, it's equilateral. All three sides and all three angles are equal. If the total perimeter then is 6, then each side is going to be 2, 2, and 2. So I now have the radius of this, uh, of this circle. And I'm going to plug that into R. 2 times pi times 4, or excuse me, 2 times pi times 2 becomes 4 pi, which if you uh, round pi to 3.14 and do that multiplication, is just so slightly greater than quantity B. So quantity A is our correct answer here.